Hello Sagittarius, welcome to my channel, welcome back uh, to my channel for some of you guys, hope you guys are doing well. This is your general love reading for uh, July. We're going to take a look and see who's showing up in it, one more. We're going to take a look and see who's showing up in your reading, see what they're thinking and feeling regarding yourself, of course, and vice versa as well. Please just take what resonates, guys, and leave what doesn't. Okay, and if this isn't your situation, if I don't pick up on uh, your situation, feel free to uh, just hang around as there sometimes could be just messages throughout this that jump out and speak to you. And uh, of course, just use this as a guide to support you and move you in the direction of where you're wanting to go. Okay, so I'm just going to take this in, uh, clarify this off, off camera, and I'll be back. So Sagittarius, let's start with reading and of course, take whatever side resonates with you guys and picking up as uh, this being your side, the person that you're dealing with over here. But you can always flip switch whatever side just kind of resonates the most. All right, so this is interesting. All right, Sagittarius, so it seems like at some point you kind of had some form of, and it could be small for, for some of you, um, some form of victory with the six of uh wands i feel like it's some victory regarding getting on top or getting one up on someone in relation to this connection it's not this person because this person has a choice it seems like they they've got a choice to make between maybe you yourself and someone else with the three of cups there but um yeah it, but it feels like you could have had some form of victory there was a bit of uh maybe a bit of conflict that you had prior to that but you know, some form of small victory, enough for you to kind of start moving slowly towards this person. Uh, this person definitely, you acknowledge, let's say that, that this person definitely has a, some form of impact in your life with the sun card there. Some form of positive impact. And you're wanting to get closer. This person feels right for you. This person feels right for you. But again, it's this small victory uh, that's caused you to kind of maybe move slowly towards this person. It's kind of giving you um, this edge of moving a bit closer to this person, let's say. Feeling, well, how do I put that? How do I put that? How do I put that? Of course, there's acknowledgement about this victory that you've had, but it's like you, it's something that you've kept a secret or you're keeping a secret that you put an end to. I feel like it's this, you know, just feeling of, okay, I put an end to that. And that's where that victory's come from. I put an end to that, I can put a stop to that thing. Uh, where your person, your person is, we've got the magician card there. The magician card there. This person wants to bring something about, but it's like they have a choice to make. It's like, who do I choose? Who do I go with? I want to get on top of this. Emotions have already developed when it comes to you. Um, but again, we've got that four of cups. There is this disappointment. This person's not really... I don't feel like they're too pleased about where they're at when it comes to ju just this choice that they're needing to make, especially with that ace of swords there, wanting a solution in order for them to start giving, uh, but they feel stuck. There is this stuck element to them, or was, because this is kind of where you guys are coming from, which brings us to where you are at the moment. You're showing up as the emperor card. So you're like wanting to take the lead on this wanting to take some form of control or just not even so much control but just more about you taking the lead on this kind of ushering this person forward towards you because you've already developed an emotional connection Sagittarius with this person so really your focus is on you know laying a stronger foundation with them starting something but there is this trap feeling that you do have simply because this person they've just not made the choice it's like I've got a choice to make so there's only so much there's only so much that you can do. There's only so much action that you can um, take with the with the Knight of Pentacles there. I feel like it's put you in the defensive mode, which is the seven. Not to say that you're... I feel like that defensive mode is causing you to want to work harder, um, even. Uh, but there is communication that you're wanting to have with this person. I'm not sure... 
or that's most probably for some of you that's either communication that you wanted to have with this person or communication that's come in some form of information that's come in but like i said this person has a choice to make we do have the three of cups there so between yourself and you're aware of it like i said there's been some form of victory over someone this third uh energy which you're quite pleased about it kind of brought you a bit closer to this person not too much but a lot closer than you was before so again it's like they still have this choice to make they're wanting to make it as well they're wanting to they're wanting to make we've got the magician card again they're wanting to because they're wanting to they're wanting to create something they're wanting to start something but again it's this decision this choice that I, that I uh, have to make and that in itself is causing them to hold back hold back not give so much not give so much yes they're wanting to move forward uh, take action but it's like there's a lack of clarity so if this person is engaging which I feel they very much are they can only do so much because they still are in this mindset of um, making a choice making a choice yeah making a choice I wanted to just kind of um, just see some. I don't know. Yeah. Bit of a sticky situation. Um, and I don't want to say sticky situation. I feel like you feel like it's more, it's dragging. It's like this person is dragging their feet or the situation is just kind of uh, dragging. I wanted to pull on that. There we go. Yeah, you're wanting to communicate something that causes some form of change. Whether this person's going to be receptive just based on the fact that they're just not in a place to make that choice just yet. Although we do have that six of wands, sorry, the six of swords there, which talks about moving forward. So there could be some movement forward, but again, they're still kind of holding back. There's only so much they can give. There's only so much they can participate um, within... Oh. So what we're going to do, we're going to move into part two of the reading, which should be pinned in the corner or description by as we speak, guys, so click on that. Um, that way we can kind of see where this moves to, see what happens next. In terms of where it stands at the moment, yeah, it's like you've been putting in work. Um, again, we've had some form of small victory, uh, but it doesn't stop this person from coming out of this place where they need to make a choice between you and someone else, someone that you're very much aware of. Um, and that's where that victory came from. You had some form of victory over that. But yeah, so links in the description bar below, guys. And I shall see you guys in a bit.